Hello gentlemen, welcome back. So I'll skip intro video and let me show you this beautiful piece of machinery. So let me describe what it is. So this is the William Skinner gravity power machine. So this is again one gravity power machine. So basically we use gravity to increase output power of the whole system. So let me now turn this a little bit around and now trying to explain component one by one. Yeah. So it's, it looks really complicated, but it's not that complicated like, uh, as it looks like. So let's start from the beginning. So you will see, so we have basically, this is some kind of flywheel system. You see some weights, for example, here, this uh, on the left uh, and on the right side of each, this uh, shaft, uh, red in the middle, uh, there, there are some counterbalanced weights, which will actually produce free energy or they will multiplicate the power of the whole system so that we are able to get output power higher than the input power we need to invest in the whole system. So let's start from the beginning. So what does start this system? Of course, this is not just purely gravity powered system. You need some energy to start this and to move this. And for this purpose, we will use this motor. So this will be our drive motor for the system. And the result of all this system from the William Skinner is that with this small motor we should increase the power 12 times on the output shaft, which is this right here on the bottom, yeah, in all these belts, yeah, in the middle of all these belts. So, so how does it work? So, so let's see. So we see that we have a drive, mo mo uh, drive engine or drive motor, which have some uh, sprockets uh, or some drive pulleys which transmit this power or multiplicate this power already with the belt mechanism and to and here to this system over here uh, so i did not uh, resolve details of the sprocket system which transfer um, mechanism from this to this axis yeah but nevertheless this is it yeah so when the power is transmitted here it is connected through these um, shafts here and connected with these flywheels which lead then to the bottom um, belts and bottom pulleys which transmit the power to the main shaft in the middle and that's it yeah? so, and this is done four times in the system so we have four flywheels if I turn this you can see there are four flywheels which transmit the power to the main shaft on the bottom on which can be connected anything with the power 12 times more stronger uh, than is the motor we are uh, moving over here yeah? and that's the that's the idea of the system so it's a gravity power system or gravity multiplicate uh, gravity power multiplicator because it uses a flywheel system to to increase the output power so it looks really complicated yeah and on the first side and it is to construct this but if it works it really it really does the work but in the end so i have to mention one thing and this is that uh, this patent is very very old so william skinner made this patent in 1939 so it's almost 100 year old it's a, actually 80 years old but nevertheless it's really amazing it looks magnificent and for this purpose in the bottom of or down in the description below you can see two uh, links uh, and two original videos which describe this device and the replica by some older guy replica of this device in smaller scale and that's basically it so this is the William Skinner gravity power machine which gives 12 time or 1200 percent more power on the output than the power we invested through the drive motor so this is it. So gentlemen, thank you very much for watching and until next video, please stay tuned on my channel. Bye bye.